I'm hungry. You have a spare 50p for a sandwich, please. Yeah, yeah, same old story. What you really need is for drugs and alcohol, dirty scum. Excuse me, look at you. Lazy drug addict making the streets look manky. You think I need you and make my money that I actually work for, you filthy vermin? I will work for you. I'll work for you. family once, you know, as happy as most until Dad ran off for a reception in 2015 when I was 12. Uh, that's not why I ended up like this. No, Vincent's to blame for that. Good old Vince, Mum's boyfriend. I'm sure Mum would have supported me, but it wasn't long until Vincent was started saying he was living on his money. It was Mum's money, but he went on and on and getting nastier and nastier, and one night when I'd been out with my mates, he beat me out of the house and locked me out the door. And so, here I am, sitting in a doorway, watching the passers-by, hoping sometimes Punch will give me a bit of change so I can eat. Okay, fine. Go waste it. But don't come back to me when you die from the dead. Thanks, Mum. Here. <laughs> Thank you so much. You really don't know how grateful I am. Really, thank you. I saw you having some trouble in there trying to persuade your family to help. Yeah, it took some persuasion. But I got home in the end. But I can see this. You have nothing, or I'll have everything. It isn't fair. You should be equal. I don't think our friends and family see it that way, then. Well, thank you for fighting and not giving up. Of course. Come on, Jason. Please get going. Yeah, Jason, there'll be no time to get the stockings off. Okay, love. I'll see you soon. Well, thank you very much and have a very Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.